Hey guys, P. Ramsey 91, and I'm bringing you a video on news I'm pretty sure most of you have heard. Capcom basically was the one who told Nintendo to put more RAM inside the Switch so that whatever engine they used for Resident Evil 7 could be used on both portable and docked mode and Nintendo Liston. So it's good that Capcom did that, or we may have had a similar situation as the Wii U. But that's not really what I want to talk about here. See, Capcom said something interesting. And I'm not going to repeat what they said exactly, but I'm going to paraphrase it. Basically, they said they, with the amount of RAM, they wanted it to be where it could work properly in both portable and docked mode, right? And that got me thinking, because what, what it, that means to me is that probably even with the amount of RAM Nintendo had before, it probably worked in docked mode, but it wasn't working as well in portable mode. Just let that sink in for a moment, because... Nintendo's, let's face it, biggest asset right now is portability, but may that also be its biggest flaw. Because imagine in the future, not this year, but let's say next year or the year after that, when maybe the Scorpio and PS4 Pro are a lot more popular and developers are like, listen, we want to, you know, make games more so for the Pro and the Scorpio because they have more power and they want to make the game more powerful. And they come to the Switch and they're like, Listen, we can, it can work in dock mode, but it can't, we can't get it to work properly in portable mode. And Nintendo will probably tell them, well, we can't have a game that has both that doesn't work in portable mode. Because we already know there's one game that works only in portable mode, but let's face it, the biggest thing with the Switch is that you can take it anywhere. So it's fine to have a game that can work only in portable mode, but it's not okay, in my opinion, to have a game that could only work in docked mode. So I don't think Nintendo will even say yes to that. And that may cause a problem in the future, in my opinion. If companies will come to Nintendo and have to get their game to work in portable mode, some companies may drop the system because they'll be like, you know what? It's too much work to try to get it to work in portable mode and we can't put that much effort into this um, console or something like that. So I'm just saying, I'm not saying this will happen, but I'm saying that's what I think might happen in the future after hearing what Capcom said because now I realize that Games, there, there may be some games that may work in docked mode, but may not work in portable mode. So, to me, this isn't a concern, obviously, for now, but like I said, in the future, it may be a concern for the Nintendo Switch. And the whole portability of the Switch, as I said, may actually be, even though it's its greatest asset, its greatest flaw. But, what do you guys think? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and may God bless you all.